Hi everybody, it's Lucia. Today I have a video, um, a requested video. Some of you are asking me how I test my jewelry, so I will show you how I test them. I got this kit out of uh, Amazon. I think it was like $29. It's Beauty Test. And it has all the um, uh, acids um, for testing 10 carat, 14, 18, 22 carat, silver and platinum. So, um, and it also came with the stone. You always want to wear gloves. I'm not wearing gloves right now because I'm having this so I won't, I won't touch anything. Um, so for silver, uh, we need to scratch uh, the object on the, on the stone and then drop uh, the silver testing solution on the line. And if it's uh, 9 to 5, it will turn dark red. So let's go ahead and... Uh, test these items that I got from my last chart and I know for sure this is not from my last chart this is uh, my my ring and I will show you this one first so what I do I do like a line a tiny little line and do not worry guys it's not gonna scratch and it's not gonna damage your uh, the jewelry so okay so we know this is number one so what I do I kind of align them in here and I test uh, a few at the time. Okay, so let's do this earring. Then, I hope you guys are able to see. Let me zoom in a little bit. Okay, so I have two lines in here. Okay, to number two, and I put them in here. Number two, then this heart. Three. Um, this pendant. Four. Uh, the ring. Five. Then I have the the dragons. I had two dragons, two earrings over there, and then I will do this. Okay, so let me take this out of the way. So I have the lines in here for this uh, jewelry, and then this is the testing solution. So the, this is very um, um, corrosive, so uh, we need to be really careful when we do this. Where am I here? So as you guys can see, the last one didn't uh, turn out bright red. It's more like a uh, pretty much invisible. So the acid pretty much melted the, the metal. I don't know if you guys are able to see the color. I will zoom in. And I'll show you here. And then, what I also like to double check, so pretty much one, two, three, four, five, um, according to the testing, they are sterling silver, but I will do it again, and this time, what am I? This time, I will wipe that solution here and this time I will do it also with um, 18 karat gold um, I like this I prefer this better when I test the silver because you can see it um, much better on this with 18 karat so we'll do it again number one Two, three, the heart, the pendant, four, the 
ring and then the dragon. So again I have the scratches over here. Okay, and then we'll do the same thing with the 18 carat. And then if it's silver, it's gonna turn like a milkish, almost like an opal color. Just add a drop here. I will zoom in. You guys can see. So pretty much number one, two, three, four, five are silver. Number six is not. Let's zoom in again. That is all. This is how I test my my jewelry, and I always double check. Um, so I always do the silver and then the 18 karat first, and I will show you one more time with this one, and I'll make a bigger scratch. Maybe this way we will be able to see. Okay. So I did a, a bigger scratch this time and I'm also using the 18 karat. So you guys can see the the milky kind of a color that means it's it's still silver. These are all silver, the earrings, the heart, the pendant, and the rings, and these ones are not the uh, dragon. And now I have this other necklace here that I thought, this one, that I thought um, these might be silver, the beads, so I will test this one also. Scratch here and let's try it again. So, yeah, the beads are also silver. You can see the tiny little white spots over there. Okay. Let me wash my hands. Okay. This is um, how I test my, my jewelry. If you have any questions, uh, please leave them on the um, box below and I will be happy to answer to your questions. Thank you so much for uh, uh, joining me. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.